In James 1, verse 25, it says, He who looks into perfect law shall be blessed in his doing. Our prayer today is for God's order in our lives. Let us pray. Dear God, it is easy to see that your world is absolutely and fully good and that there is meaning and there is purpose in all things. We pray that our world flows along smoothly and easily, and we pray that the power of our prayers is blessing every aspect, every corner of our world. We know that even when problems come up, when everything we touch seems to be tangled or confused, we can turn to you, God, and we turn to you now for divine order, for your order, God, not human order. We pray in this way to lift us above any problem that we have. And we pray for the grace that does so, that lifts us to a place where we can look at our problem realistically and unemotionally. And dear God, from this vantage point, we take stock in the state of our affairs. We see them in the light of truth, your light, God, and we see the necessary adjustments that must be made, adjustments in our way of thinking as well as outer actions. We ask you to guide us in your order, God, God's order. As we pray, we know that even right now, right answers are being given to us. And we right now, begin to set about to make things right. Along with these right answers, God, we pray that we are given the strength. We pray that we are given the courage to follow through with what you say to do and that we will understand, that we will know what to do and we will do it. Our prayer this day is for God's divine order to cover our lives like an umbrella and to infill us with strength and power and well-being. In Jesus Christ's name we pray. Amen.